Hey guys, it's your girl Brianna here, aka Beauty's Advocate, and today I'm going to show you guys how I got these super defined luscious curls on blown out hair using flexi rods. Okay guys, if you missed my Rev Air initial review, please go back and watch that. This has become my new absolute favorite tool to use to blow out my hair. So what I'm doing is first I put in half a pump of the Paul Mitchell Super Skinny Serum. Then I went in with my Kenra Platinum Heat Protective Blow Dry Spray and I just pretty much spray that liberally throughout my head until I feel like it's enough in there and it's pretty coated. And then I use my Melanin Hair Care Leave-In. I love that stuff. It smells so good and leaves my hair so soft. After I put all of those products in my hair, I just go in and detangle in small sections. Now that I'm done detangling, I'm just gonna rev out this hair. This has honestly just become like one of my favorite hair tools. I'm really glad that I actually spent the $300 on this because it's just made blow drying so much easier. I never really had an issue getting my hair blown out straight before. You guys have seen my previous videos. I'm actually pretty good at it. If I must say so myself, I will to my own horn on that. But I will say that with this, I just feel like, you know, there's not as much tugging on my hair, number one. I don't have to constantly Constantly hold a paddle brush in one hand the blow dryer in the other and keep going down in this downward motion until it's blown out straight it's just like way less effort and how this works basically is you detangle your hair really well you put it inside of that suction and then you move that top piece around on your scalp um, so that you can make sure like all of the roots are hit up because it does dry your roots which is freaking amazing and after that you just pull it out a couple of inches to check the roots to make sure it's dry and then I like to put a comb through it as I pull it out and just let the silkiness happen like look at this y'all look like girl that was like no effort to just hold that up there and um, depending on how large of the section it takes me between like I would say 30 seconds and about like a little over a minute so the larger sections obviously take longer, the smaller sections take, you know, a less amount of time. Okay, so I'm gonna keep it real, y'all. I got really tired <laughs> the day that I filmed this and it was pretty late at night, so I decided to just go to sleep. And this is actually the next day that I'm doing the flexi rods. But all I really do is I take some of my Tejan Daily Moisturizer Buttercream and then I take some of the Melanin Hair Care Oil. I work all of that through my head in that order. As you see, I'm really focusing on those ends, rubbing it. And after I comb it out, this is the Felicia Leatherwood brush, which um, I could give you a review on that. It's not my favorite. I, I think I'm just used to my tangle teaser. Um, I take the flexi rod, I put it at the root, and then I just start wrapping my hair around like you would if you were wand curling your hair. So I kind of like wrap and twist my wrist at the same time so that it kind of creates, I guess, kind of like a rope effect. When you get to the end, I like to just smooth those hairs down, bend it right over the end that was smoothed down so that no hair is sticking out, and then bend the end next to my roots. And that's literally all I do. So I'll up at the top, I do take slightly smaller sections. As you can see right here, that section is a lot smaller than the one that I did, and it's because I like my curls to kind of fall in a face frame. But I literally just repeat this process throughout my entire head until it is done. Okay, and I'm just going to put in a little shameless plug here. If you are not yet subscribed to my channel, please subscribe, turn on the notification bell, and like this video. I truly, truly appreciate everyone that's been subscribing, commenting, liking. I try to, you know, reply to everyone. You guys are all awesome, and I really do love the support. So thank you so much for that, and if you are new, just hit that button, girl. Okay, so this is what my hair looks like now that it is all done. I'm just going to throw this bonnet on my head and go to sleep. So good night, and I'll be right back. Hey, it's morning already. Look at that.
all right that one kind of like upset me right there because the end came out usually i will add like some water or some more product onto the end sometimes especially if it's like day two or three when i'm doing this because honestly you guys at night i literally receive repeat the same process i don't add more product until i feel like my hair is starting to like lose moisture um, but I literally repeat this process and then I will like go over my entire head and just do like the lightest mist of water I feel like it helps reset the curls to the mold um, And that's like all I do and I can wear my hair like this for over a week And I feel like a week is actually a really good time frame to have a style when it's natural because I work out I work on my house we're renovating um, I'm pretty active, so to be able to have a cute style like this that I can wear for a week is like awesome. Okay, y'all, so when I separate, I actually like to flip my hair upside down like that and like tease out the roots a little bit. I feel like it adds more volume, it makes it bigger. Oh my gosh, you see how easy that was? That's like the easiest separation ever. Then I'll actually go through and, you know, pick out big chunks like that and separate them with my fingers. But I feel like for some reason when I flip it upside down, it creates the perfect amount of frizz because I do like a little I can't lie y'all and I just think like it separates it in like the easiest easiest way and this is the final look as the days go on this does get larger which is why I try not to separate too much on the first day but this is literally it I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much please don't forget to like and subscribe